Hi, Angela Wills here from MarketersMojo.com and I did a video on how to use Google to submit to directories, all kinds of directories, submitting to article directories, website directories, blog directories, all these different ways you can get your information out there and get some traffic coming back a lot faster than if you're not letting letting yourself um, get out there and, and let other people know about you. So using directories is a good thing. You want to make sure you use quality directories. And one of the things the video covered was article directories. And in the video, I had a page that was basically an HTML page, which is a website page. And what I did was just load that up. And I'll actually, I'll show you the page. Here it is. It's just basically I opened up a file from my computer which looks like a web page. Now what I did to find this list was actually just I did a Google search of article directories. So you can do that. You can actually search directories one by one or you can do a Google search for a list of directories. So I uh, searched like top article directories, something like that, and I got this list of top 50 directories. So if you want to submit to blog directories or podcast directories or submit um, your affiliate program to different directories, just start using Google and you'll find all kinds of them. Make sure they're reputable, you know, kind of check them out that way. Here is one listing I did find just by searching Google. Basically, it's um, got the 50 article directories and they're ranked by traffic and page rank. And Alexa page rank, the lower it is, the better. So 168 means that Ezine Articles is the 168th most popular website on the internet. And that is huge because there's a whole lot of websites on the internet. I don't have any idea how, but I think it's, you know, in high, high millions or possibly a billion. I'm, I'm not sure. But so I got a great question. And the question was, how do you create this page here? Well, you don't necessarily have to create this page because you could actually just bookmark a, pa a list like this right from the website and use that. Or you can create your own page. And I, one of the things I did to create this page, this page is on my computer. It's not on the internet. What I did to create that was I used a program called MVU. And I also used, I just kind of copied a list like this. But you could also, you know, create your own list and then create a page with that list on it. So I'm going to show you how I used NVU because it's a program you can certainly use to to do the same thing. And you can use it to create web pages as well if you don't know how to do that. So I'm just show you how I how I how you can find it. Just click NVU and it's NVU web authoring software. Click on that. And then when you get to this page, click the big download button here. And then just scroll down. So it's taking you to the download page and the version I for me, because I have Windows, I would pick Microsoft Windows full installer. If you have a Mac, you're going to need something else. But I would just click the download link here and then I would save that and install it. So um, you do that and then you have NVU on your computer. And here it is right here. Um, this is the NVU program. And basically, you know, you can. You can use this similar to how you would use Microsoft Office um, if you want to create your own links by searching and building your own. You can you just type in the address or you could type in the name. Let's give an example, easingarticles.com. So I just typed that in, easingarticles.com. I highlight over it and then up here there's a link button. So I just click the link. And in here, it's asking me to enter a web page location, local file, email address. Basically, it's asking me where do I want it to link to. So that's what's called the link location. And then I fill that out right here. And that's the only thing I'm going to fill out. You don't need to worry about all this stuff. It's a lot of extras. I don't even know what this friendship thing is. I've never heard of that anywhere else. So you can just ignore that. I just click OK. 
and then it creates a link so you can just go ahead and do that and you know you can use this like you know much like you would use Microsoft Word it can create bullets you can bold stuff this is really you know kind of the basics of creating a page and then what you would do is go file save as now it's asking for a title so I'll just call it article directories and then maybe I want to save it on my desktop and I'll just save it as article directories so here it is and it's just basically an HTML file right on my desktop I double click it and there it is that's the page that we just created and then when I click that it's going to take me to easy in articles now one thing it did was actually it took me to easy in articles and it took me away from that page so you don't want it to do that so one thing you can do is hit the control button the control button is usually in the bottom left corner if I hit control before I click the link click push control hold it down and click the link while I'm still holding control it opens up in a new page so and then that way it opens up in another page and I don't have to open this up again I hope that makes sense um, the other thing you can do is when you're using NVU let me see if I can do that so when you're creating this link like I showed you before there is uh, a link property instead of ignoring this bottom part there's a target here so you can do link to be opened in a new window so all you have to do is put a check mark on here and then make sure it's selected in a new window click OK I'll save this again and then I'll go back here I'm going to refresh this close the easy in articles and now when I click it without clicking control it's going to open up in a new window so this is really basic on how to you know use uh, a website editor but NVU is a great editor to start with and it's totally free you saw I just downloaded I showed you how to download it you can just go to NVU uh, type that into Google and the address the actual address is net2.com forward slash NVU and that will get you there and then forward slash download dot html so if you want to go to this address here that will also get you right to the download where you can use that um, I'll also just uh, I'll do a page that you can actually even just load into NVU and you can use that open that up and go ahead and use it to submit to articles directories or edit it how you like and hopefully that will be helpful for you as well so that's just been a little bit of inf extra information for you about how to go ahead and use an HTML page to link out that you just have on your web on your computer you can open up I keep it in my systems folder I have create systems for everything I do and I keep it there and I know exactly where to find it and um, and then I will use it so um, thanks for your questions and ask me any questions if anything's not clear I'm happy to help and provide you with this information this is what I love to do and I definitely want to help you find your marketers mojo by making things faster easier to do and making things that that will get you results and that you will do so you get those results so that's it for now I'm Angela Wills